how to mint nfts on open seas without gas fees hi guys in this video i'm going to be telling you how you can mint nfts on open seas without having to pay any gas so without wasting any more of your time let's just jump into the video so the first thing that i want you guys to do is come over to open seas now once you're over here all you have to do is just simply create your nft but before that i do have to tell you that many websites require a gas fee now gas fee is basically you could say like a percentage of your earnings that the website keeps for itself now it can be very very expensive because the ethereum prices and the cryptocurrency prices are always fluctuating so the gas prices can also be increased and decreased and it also depends upon the rate of gas that people are paying so if you want to check it out you can come over to this website and over here as you can see the gas rate is 74 which is quite a lot actually so if you have to keep that in mind that if you want to pay gas fee you have to pay a quite a lot of money so to you know upload an nft but there are websites where you don't have to like pay gas fees but unfortunately OpenSea is one of the biggest platforms for nft and you have to pay gas but in this video i'm going to be telling you how you can do that without having to you know pay for it so the first thing that i want you guys to do is come over here and sign up so just simply create an account and just simply link your wallet now i use metamask and ronin wallet whichever one suits you best just simply connect your wallet with open seas and you are good to go so i'm going to go ahead and do that and i'm going to sign in and once you click on sign in your metamask wallet is going to pop up and it will look something like this and over here all you simply have to do is just simply click on next and all you have to do is click on connect and once it's connected the web the web page will load up and it will look something like this. so i'm gonna go over here and open seas and i'm gonna go ahead and upload my nfts so basically before we go ahead and upload our nfts what we want to do is basically create a collection now to create a collection come over to your profile and click on my collections and over here as you can see we have no collections created simply click on create a collection and over here just simply add in a logo and i'm going to go ahead and add this logo over here and i'm going to go ahead and add this nft over here and as you can see this is how it looks like and then down below just simply enter in your banner image if you have one this is completely optional you don't have to do that but if you have one it'll look nice and then down below just simply add in the name of your nft and then add in a description and also if you have a customized url then you can go ahead and copy this url as well just simply add in the name of your nft at the end with the scores and then you're good to go and then also add in a description and then over here add category now you can also add in your own websites if you have like a instagram account or a twitter account for your nfts so that people can go ahead and check out and basically it'll also help you have a better sale and then down below you have your royalties i know you can set your royalties like whatever you want the maximum number of royalties that you can add is 10 so add in 10 and then just simply add in your payout wallet address down below this is the main thing that i wanted to show you guys now over here all you have to do is just simply change the ethereum to polygon now as you can see polygon is as just as fast it's also gas free so you don't have to pay gas now this is the one thing that i want to show you guys this is basically the trick this is how you basically upload uh, your collection your nfts on open seas without having to pay any gas fees as well so and then down below over here just simply add in your wallet address let me just go ahead and do that actually and i will catch you guys in a little bit so once you have added it just simply click on create and then that will basically be it and also you have to like enter in your category so if your category falls into the art uh category then go ahead and click on art if it's trading cards then you can choose that category then you have collectibles sports and utility i think my one mine falls into the art one i'm just simply gonna click on art and then after that i'm just simply gonna choose my display theme over here you can see we have padded contain or covered i'm gonna choose covered because i think it uh, it looks more cool so now i'm gonna simply click on create and see my wallet is telling me to create create uh the nft is asking me for my signature then i'm gonna click on sign and oh, i think it's over here i think i have to lower case these as well now i think we're good to go now we can just invalid slug must contain lowercase lemon i think it's done okay let me just change this up to this i think i created one before so that's why it's telling me that it's already created so this url is valid now so we can just go ahead and click on create and the issue should be resolved and as you can see the collection has been created now we can just go ahead and create our own nft 
So now let's go back to open seas and click on create. And over here, basically just drag and drop the file that you want to upload. So I'm going to go ahead and upload this one over here. And then all you have to do is just add in the name, then add in the site and then add your description. And over here, basically you have to choose your collection. Now, once you have done that, you can also add in your properties, levels, stats, and relocable content if you have one. And then over here, you have your supply. So basically, you can add in as many as you want since, but as you can see, I've already added one. So I can't, you know, add more. And then down below, change the blockchain to Polygon. So you don't have to pay any gas fees whatsoever. And then once that is done, just simply click on create and it will be done. I'm going to go ahead and add my name of my NFT over here. So I'm going to go ahead and add in the white skull and then down below, if you have an external link, that's pretty cool. If you have one, if you don't have one, I think you can skip it and then just add in the description, check your collection. If you have, want to add in more properties, levels and stat, go ahead and do that. And once you have done that, just simply click on create, wait for it to process a little bit. Then it will tell you that you have cre just created the white skull and this is it. Then you can just go ahead and share it onto your social media and Facebook, LinkedIn account and many, many more. And then that is basically it. So now a lot of people think like, polygon doesn't have any nft so i'm gonna show you guys some pretty cool ones so if i come over here on the marketplace and i'll go over here on the filter section and i'll have to choose polygon now once i choose polygon these are the only nfts that are going to show up now as you can see they're pretty cool over here as you can see the z one this is basically that horse the this is a very popular nft like all i'm sure many of you have seen it as well like this one as well like this jacket one like these are pretty cool nfts that people can you know buy with polygon and the, the best thing is that you don't have to pay any gas fees whatsoever so that is it for this video guys that is how you upload your nfts on open seas without having to pay any gas fees now i'm sure that some of you want don't want to use polygon or whatsoever so for those of you who don't want to use it the i have another website for you and it's called mintable now let me go over here real quick now let me just show you a little bit about that website as well so as you can see mintable is pretty cool as well it's just like open seas but unlike open seas it's completely free and you don't have to pay any gas fees whatsoever even on ethereum like it's completely free you don't have to pay any gas fees even on ethereum so that is pretty cool so if you want to go ahead and check this website out it's pretty cool as well like it has some pretty amazing nfts on it as well so if you want to buy and sell nfts in ethereum but you don't want to pay gas fees and open seas might not be for you then you might have to come over to mintable so that is it for this video guys that is how you upload nfts onto open seas without having to pay any gas fees. now the way i showed you like you have to create a collection now you don't have to basically do that i just basically showed you because collections sell better than just simple nfts so you know basically it's it has a higher probability of selling faster than a single nft so if you have a collection go ahead and sell it because it's going to sell faster so that is it for this video guys if you guys enjoyed this video please hit the like button and also subscribe to our channel because we are uploading videos like these almost daily so you don't have to worry about running out of content or stuff like that so make sure you hit the like button subscribe to our channel and if you have any questions let me know in the comment sections down below and i'll be sure to answer them as soon as possible so having said that i will catch you guys in the next video and until then take care and goodbye